Hello, we fixing everything and because there is always something to fix today, we'll see how to change the bulb on the fog light on uh, the Fira A, MK1. Now, easiest thing is to take the bumper off and I have a video on how to do it, but this time I'll try without taking the bumper off. I have jacked up the car and I put a jack stand underneath it and now There is this uh, cooling duct that goes into the brakes that needs to be undone, which it's holding itself by three screws or four maybe. This one here, this one here, and this one right there. So I'll try to undo of them. Actually the one already slipped off maybe when you hit something. If you have a protective glasses it's gonna be even better. This is the connector for the power. If you spray it a little bit with the silicone oil, it should definitely be easier for you. Sometimes, uh, at least on the other side, it's like a plastic twist lock. This one is original, I think. GM. Or is it? I don't know. But sometimes the opening is a little bit different. Okay, so what we have here is the connection itself that uh, you need two hands to undo this one. And now this one is a little bit tricky, but I'll do it with one hand, you can do it with two hands. There are on clips here. And the bulb falls off Yeah. So exactly the same is to put it on. There is a direction, can you see the two notches? There is two notches as well, here. So you put it correctly in. Not that it matters that much, but still, can you see it? One here and one on the other side, 12 o'clock and 6 o'clock. So it's just like this, okay? I just noticed something because the test probe is working, but this light it isn't working. It's maybe because there is a diode on the inside that uh, uh, follows the polarity. So, um, yeah, polarity is wrong and it doesn't light up. Not very nice. Okay, so what I did, connected the, I swapped the cables here, plugged it in, plugged it in here, and in the moment I touched the main part, it lighted up, so. So good. Now I will just close it up. This rubber is protecting it from short, so make sure it's nicely seated. There you go, just like this. And now we are going to cover it up. I'm watching what I'm doing through the phone, so I can feel there is a broken. Oh yeah, this one here is broken, so it will wobble over the place, but. It's definitely better than nothing. I'll try to glue it up still. Okay, let's uh, let's see if it works. It does work. But it's flickering. I don't know if you can notice it, but... 
It stopped flickering now. That's because of the Chinesium inside. <laughs> okay, so that's how to uh, swap the bulb on uh, the Fury.